I'm my ancestors' wildest dream and their oppressors' worst nightmare. And I'm not. Yes, finished. indeed. Yes, indeed. And I need other people to 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 feel that that fire and that burn and know that you're worthy. We are a melanin magic. Like, do you understand? A lot of our people wasn't given the tools. Our parents wasn't given the tools. Their parents wasn't given the tools. So it's a generational issue that we're dealing with. And it's going to be very hard to break down, but nothing is impossible. We got to do what we got to do to make sure people know that we matter. Make sure we understand that we matter. You are enough. Our people are enough. And if they don't think they're enough, we're going to show them that they are enough. And that's only with community, love, education, and guidance. Like... That's the only way we're going to get there. Yeah, that's that's so key. And like we're it's Black History Month. And as much as you know, people sometimes reflect on history and the oppression that black folk have had to um, continue to navigate through. Um, you know, this is also a time where we celebrate the contributions um, that we've made to our collective progression, we've made to US history, um, we've made to our societies. And I think it's just so important that in addition to talking about our accomplishments, that we not forsake the opportunity to really invest in our sense of worth and value and belonging and empoweredness because that is what's gonna to continue to take us through. So I appreciate you for like honing in there um, in, in reminding black folk, not only that we're beautiful, um, but that we're bountiful, that we're blessed, um, and, and that we have brilliance out of this world 